This short video will provide you with an overview of the Agilent 86108B Precision Waveform Analyzer, the newest plugin module for the 86100C DCAJ and the 86100D DCAX Wide Bandwidth Oscilloscope Platform. The 86108B has been engineered for precision waveform analysis on high-speed digital designs to 32 gigabits per second. The 86108B provides engineers and designers with unprecedented performance, providing more margin for your designs. It does this by providing wide analog bandwidth, with a precision time base, and provide the world's lowest time base jitter at less than 50 femtoseconds RMS. The 108B also has the widest clock recovery range, providing continuous data rate coverage from 50 megabits per second all the way to 32 gigabits per second. The 108B provides unmatched value and flexibility, which reduces product development times and costs. Finally, the 86100D mainframe, together with the 86108B, provide very advanced analysis capabilities which allow designers to validate their designs more quickly. We'll start with a quick demo that illustrates the precision measurement capability in the ultra-low time-based jitter of the 86108B. With only one button push, we can switch into jitter mode and do a very in-depth analysis of the jitter on the incoming signal. So jitter mode automatically analyzes the data rate, the pattern length, and then separates the jitter into random and deterministic components and then calculates total jitter at a user-specified BER. Here you can see that the random jitter is well below 50 femtoseconds RMS, which gives the designer confidence that when you're measuring a high-speed signal, such as a 28 gigabit signal, the jitter measurement is that of your DUT, and the contribution from the scope is negligible. As data rates increase to 28 gigabits per second and beyond, accurate component characterization becomes more difficult. Devices such as this 28 nanometer Surtees core from Avago Technologies can benefit from the measurement performance of the 86108B as it can quickly and accurately measure the core's high signal integrity and exceptional jitter performance. This Surtees supports numerous standards that range all the way from 1 gigabit to 28 gigabits per second and beyond. As noted earlier, this setup is very quick and easy. Shown here is a jitter measurement on a differential pair operating at 28.05 gigabits per second. The 86108B helps designers make accurate measurements on devices such as these where the random jitter is less than 350 femtoseconds and the total jitter estimated at 10 to the minus 12 is less than 10 picoseconds. There are times when a designer needs to be able to analyze a signal after it's passed through a lossy channel such as a backplane. In cases like this, sometimes the loss or the inter symbol interference that's introduced can be so excessive that it can actually close the eye diagram. In a case such as this, the hardware clock recovery may not be able to recover a clock and therefore there wouldn't be any trigger for the oscilloscope. The 86108B module includes an auxiliary clock recovery input that helps to address this issue. Designers can normally configure the transmitter so that an adjacent channel can operate at a subrate of the main signal under test, or the adjacent signal could be set up as a clock signal as well. The key in this setup is that the jitter profile on the main signal under test connected to channel 1 and 2 is going to be very similar to the signal shown here going into the auxiliary clock recovery input. Another possible solution would be to use the reference clock signal. It's possible to evaluate the effectiveness of an equalizer on that closed eye by applying a software CTLE or Continuous Time Linear Equalizer or LFE, Linear Feed Forward Equalizer, and then open the eye. InfiniSim DCA is embedding and de-embedding software for Flex DCA. It's easy to configure Flex DCA to remove or de-embed the effects of a fixture or a cable and open the eye in order to improve measurement margins. 86108B Option JSA provides jitter spectrum analysis and software clock recovery emulation capability using a real-time acquisition system inside the clock recovery circuit. The 86108B can measure and display the jitter spectrum of a data or clock signal. Similar to phase noise plots from a spectrum analyzer, these spectral views provide valuable insight into jitter. 
and can help track root cause of excessive jitter to a reference clock, for example. Option JSA also provides engineers with the flexibility of analyzing their designs using software clock recovery emulation. Ideal first, second, and third order clock recovery designs with adjustable loop bandwidth and peaking can be configured. The ideal software CRE design can be used to optimize jitter mode results by removing the effects of any non-ideal response from the hardware clock recovery. For more information, please visit www.agilent.com forward slash find forward slash 86108B.